All right, so you guys see what's in front of me. It's a bunch of frozen turkey dinners. So pretty much not everybody can go home for the holidays. Some people have to work. So I wanted to see what frozen dinner is the best dinner to buy for your Christmas night. So me and Ryan are gonna be tasting these. I'll be on camera, Ryan will be off camera, and we'll determine which one of these is the best uh, frozen turkey dinner. Yeah, so I'm going all out. I'm gonna pretend like it's Christmas Eve, Christmas Day, and uh, I have some ice because I'm drinking some sangria, and I forgot to chill it. Um, you know, just a little bit of Sutter Homes. The first meal is almost ready. It's already in the microwave. You know, just making it, making it work. So this is the first one. This is from Walmart. I'm just gonna mix the mashed potatoes. They have green beans and carrots. And then the turkey is in like the sauce. So let me taste it. Would it be sauce or gravy? It's gravy, sorry. I'm gonna bite that cuts all three. I should get a little plate for it. And get some stuff and then hand it to my hussy. Hussy, husband. <laughs> it's hot. The mashed potatoes are good. Mm. The turkey's a little gummy, but it still has like good flavor. The gravy has really good flavor. The veggies are a no for me. They're kind of already like dehydrated and then, I don't know, I don't like the taste of it. So me, my rating is probably like a, let's start at a five. I'll do a five on this one. How about you, Ryan? What is the rating system out of? One out of 10. 10 being the best, five, uh, one being the, the worst thing you've ever eaten in your life. I wouldn't mind eating this again. Okay. I would say seven. Seven? Okay. It needs a little bit of like pepper. If you add a little more seasoning to it, you can see a little bit of pepper. Mm -hmm. Need a little bit of garlic powder, it'll be fine. Mm -hmm. Alright, so we have the second contender, which is Stouffer's Roast Turkey. It has white meat, stuffing, homestyle gravy with russet mashed potatoes. So let me grab a little bite. It has a little bit of stuffing. I know you like stuffing, Ryan. I like how the container on this one's kind of separate. So I'm not sure if that's good or bad. That it's separate? Yeah, because the, one, the first one from Walmart, it was all one container, so everything kind of got mushed yeah. together. This one, they're keeping it deliberately separate. For Look certain, at the for texture of the ma mashed potatoes, though. Yeah, it's a little bit different. It's a little goopy. But also, if you look at it closely, there's like little bits of uh, actual potato in there. It looks like little clumps. You're right. I'm not a fan of mashed potatoes. The, the texture is not there. It's not as good as the texture in the uh, Walmart one. Mm. I don't think it's a good idea to do stuffing in these. The, 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 the turkey's better though. It is? Try the turkey. Mm. The turkey is much better, actually. It's 90 difference. Hmm. I don't like the, ma the mashed potato or the stuffing, but the turkey is a lot better. Yeah, I agree. The mashed potatoes in the Walmart brand, I don't know what they did differently, or maybe it's just like the, the pouch mashed potatoes, the one you just add water to it. Yeah. But that one has a good taste. The texture is nice and creamy because it has gravy next to it, it like compiles together. It's just a really yeah. good flavor. The Stouffer so far, potatoes are watery. 
Yeah, you they don't, are. You don't want watery potatoes. No, they're really, really runny. So they're not good. The stuffing tastes like stovetop stuffing. Which is, but it's soggy. But it's soggy because they added their own gravy to it. The turkey is actually really good. Yeah, not gummy. It's like it's like if you're if you're eating part of a breast of like an actual turkey. Um, so this is the question now: Is this better? Zeus. <laughs> <laughs> good boy. Good boy. So this is the question: Is this better than the Walmart brand one? Would you buy the Walmart brand over the Stouffer's? I would buy the Walmart brand over the Stouffer's. I so would. I'm gonna give the Stouffer's a four. What are you gonna give? I'm gonna give it a four as well. A four. Yeah, I started at seven, work, went this one down to four. Yeah. All right, let's move on to Lean Cuisine. All right, so this is Lean Cuisine. It is roasted turkey breast with savory herb dressing, which is the uh, stuffing, and then cinnamon apples. So this one's a little different, and I want you guys to remind you guys that we're not judging it based on if it has the, the, the same things. We're judging it as what is the best holiday dinner that you can have as a frozen dinner. So even if this has something different and includes dessert, this might make it so that it's one of the best ones. So let's taste it. You want to grab some? Yeah, I'll put my fork through and we'll grab just a little bit. And I'm going to say that the gravy on this one looks a little like thick. Mmm, but it's good. Taste it. Wow, that's really good. Is that? Mmm. Whoa. Lean Cuisine. Lean Cuisine has it. Wow. So this tastes like leftovers. Mm-hmm. Like, if I were to compare with anything, it's like homey leftovers. Yeah. The stuffing, not soggy. You can still, you can still get kind of that crunch. The gravy is seasoned. Yeah, it's seasoned well too. It's not, it doesn't have potatoes, but honestly, I don't miss them. Like, it's not like, I hate it because it doesn't have potatoes. I think because it has more turkey. In yeah. the other two we had so far, there was less turkey. The main, the main focus was the potatoes. Yeah. This one's like, you know what, we're not gonna give you potatoes. You get potatoes in a pouch or make it yourself. Yeah. Go for it. This is just like, we're gonna give you. We're gonna give you turkey. Freaking meat. We're like, gonna give you delicious turkey. We're gonna give you actually pretty good stuffing and dessert. Yeah, and the apples work really well. Yeah, the dessert is actually really good too. <laughs> yeah, this is hard. Mm. So the apples maybe just need a little bit of crunch on top. Like maybe you can put like some granola or something, but. Even if you don't, like it's really freaking good. It's basically like a hot apple pie without the crust. Without the crust. Okay, so your Walmart, you rated that originally as a five. Yes. Still fridge is a four. Mm-hmm. Lean cuisine, or what do you put this at? I'm gonna put this at a nine. I'm gonna do a nine as well, because okay. just in case there's another one that's better. Yeah, this that's one. me too. Marie Callender's is next. So that one might take the 10, but this one for right now, that one is actually the best one. Yeah, I would definitely buy that again. Mm -hmm. Like it's good enough to, you know what, if you just want to get really... Easy. Like a really easy... <laughs> um, turkey dinner. Turkey dinner and you just don't have time to prep. Yeah. It's really It's good. not a whole turkey, but it's good enough in quality. Yeah, it's good. All right, let me get the uh, Marie Callender's. All right, the next one is the Marie Callender's meal. It is roasted turkey breast and stuffing uh, with creamy mashed potatoes, homestyle stuffing with vegetables and a savory gravy. So this one also has it separated, the veggies. Zeus. Zeus. 
The veggies actually look so much better than the first one, which was the Walmart one. So I'm excited to try it out. Let me mix it a little bit to get all the flavors together. I am gonna say this has almost no turkey. Like it has six little pieces of turkey. That's it? That's it. What was the other one we had before? Uh, so, um, Lean Cuisine. Yeah, Lean Cuisine, they, they don't skip on the turkey. No, they give you a lot of turkey. There's like, they, they know what you want. You, this mm -hmm. is a turkey dinner, this is a turkey dinner. Yeah. But yeah, there's not that much turkey here. So stuffing, okay, mashed yeah. potatoes. And the, turkeys, and the turkey that they have is cube formed. It's not like strips or anything yeah, like that. Yeah, I got a strip. Oh, I got a cube. Yeah. But it's good. I think it has the, the texture of turkey, like the best texture of turkey that we've had. Mashed potatoes are good. And the stuffing, you can see the celery and the carrots in the stuffing. So it's not just bread, like they actually prepared it. So the stuffing tastes like stovetop stuffing. It's not um, watered down because of the gravy. It's nice and consistently like moist. It's not yeah. dry. It's not a watery. It's actually pretty good. How they did that, I don't know, <laughs> but it's really good. The potatoes are, are uh, I think the same potatoes as the Walmart one. You think so? I think that it's like the same type. <clears throat> it's with the potatoes in the back. <coughs> Walmart gravy was good. The Lean Cuisine's gravy, I liked it better. Okay. I may have to taste it again. And this one's good too. Yeah. But it's just different. It's, it's more lighter, it's not as heavy. I think this is my favorite turkey though. Yeah, the turkey on this one is a, a lot more moist. It's not, turkey? um. Because you only had a little piece. Yeah. The veggies, they have a better texture than the Walmart ones, but they still need more flavor. It has zero flavor. It needs like salt and pepper. They're they're nice and plump. Like they didn't they didn't dehydrate like the ones from Walmart. Yeah, they're still good. Mm -hmm. But between the uh, lean cuisine to so this one, which one had a better turkey? This is what I'm basing my my point to. I'm gonna give it an eight. Okay, reason. I prefer to have the apple uh, dessert than the vegetables because the vegetables taste like crap. Yeah, but one thing to know for, for Lee Cuisine is they give you actual... Yeah, like, that, that turkey is good. They give you like good pieces of turkey. And like, like um, Marie Callender's, it's good, but they only give you so little. Very, very little. So I'm gonna give Marie Callender's an eight. It, it, it's, it's an upgrade from the Walmart. So I'll be eight as well. Because Walmart was a seven for me. Okay. The Lee Cuisines was a nine. Yeah. Marie Callender's is like a step above Walmart, but a step below Lee Cuisines. Mm -hmm. All right, the last one that we have is the Hungry Man turkey dinner. So let me go get it. This one looks a little different, so I'm interested in how it's gonna taste. So, this one is the Hungry Man Roasted Carved White Meat Turkey with mashed potatoes, gravy, mixed vegetables, seasoned stuffing, and apple cranberry compote. What's That's compote? A, um, it's like, uh, not a jelly, but like if you mix like a berry and like other things together, it creates like kind of like this. It's like juicy type of dessert. Okay. That's what that is. All right. Looks interesting. This one looks a little more messy. It does. It doesn't look pretty. <laughs> it's like hungry man. <laughs> yeah, they just slab the gravy on. Mm -hmm. uh, I'll see behind the gravy there's stuffing. So yeah. everything's kind of just like slab together. One of the main benefits for this one, though, is you do get more turkey. Yeah, you get three pieces 
Four pieces. Oh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, four pieces of carved turkey. I'm gonna show you guys. Boom, that's what it looks like. And I got a little bit of mashed potatoes. Potatoes look good, actually. And the veggies, um, it includes corn as well. And then um, like fully cut carrots, like in circles, versus shredded carrots. Hot, really, really hot. Not bad. Turkey's pretty good. These potatoes are thicker. Is mm -hmm. that the Walmart potatoes and the uh, potatoes we got from the from the uh, Marie Calendars, where they're thicker? I do have to say the Stouffer's potatoes thickened up after a while, but the the Walmart ones and the Hungry Man they were thick from the start. Like even taking them right out of the microwave, they were pretty thick. I like a thick potato. But still for flavoring, even if the consistency is correct, the taste is, I'm gonna say gross. Like, I don't like the mashed potatoes for the Stouffer's. Yeah, it's, it's not good. I can taste their meat again. It's dry now. The meat is dry now for Stouffer's. How are the veggies? Are they good? Yeah, not bad. Did they actually season them? The corn adds a sweetness. Yeah, the corn adds a sweetness. The cor it tastes like corn. You can't taste the carrots, you can't taste the green beans. You just taste corn. Mm -hmm. Which I'm not mad about, I love corn. Yeah, I do, I do too, but you, there's, you can't taste the difference. I was eating corn out of a can yesterday. I just, I love corn. <laughs> My wife, people of the internet. <laughs> Did you taste the dessert yet? Oh, no. <clears throat> Let's see what this is all about. Not bad. It has apple in it? Yeah, they both have apple. All you taste is the apple for the hard. hungry man. What, Link, what's, what's going I on? I like the cuisines more. You do? Yeah. The turkey has better flavor than Link Cuisines in my opinion. See, the stuffing is already draining out at the Link Cuisine though. Yeah, but, but but you're looking for a turkey, right? I'm looking for overall. Overall? So, the Hungry Man's more of a meal. If you want a meal, like a full meal, just nuke it up, and you do nothing else to it. 100% hungry men. You, you don't have, you get, you, the only thing you have to do maybe put salt and pepper, that's it. it. It's good out, it's good out of the case. The Lean Cuisine, because it doesn't have the vegetables, because it doesn't have <clears throat> the carrots, the potatoes, it's just turkey mm -hmm. and a dessert. That's less of a meal. Mm -hmm. But I do like the flavors more. Now, <clears throat> this video is for best overall meal. I'll give it a hungry man. Me too. Are you gonna are you gonna give it a ten? I'll give it um an eight. So it's less than the link cuisine. Yeah, because I like the flavors better. But it, if it was what tasted, mm -hmm. if it. If it was what tasted better, I would say Lee Cuisine. But you want to do something what's better overall. Mm -hmm. What's a better meal? I haven't given my rating. So you're going to give it an 8? I'm going to give it an 8. I'm going to give it a 9. So based on our... Based on our pointage... Based on our pointage, we have Lean Cuisine as first. Hungry Man is second, Marie Calendars is third, <clears throat> Walmart as fourth, and then Stouffer's dead last. And I agree, Stouffer's was kind of really gross. Yeah. So, 
That's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did, go ahead and like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Try this one and then try that one. Marie Callender's enough? No. I can't believe Marie Callender's only gave us like six pieces of chicken <laughs> or turkey. Whatever That's right, it it's for the name. Mm. But it's flavored really nicely. Yeah, but compared to Lee Le Le Cuisine's? Yeah. Yeah, Lee Cuisine has the best flavor. Mm -hmm. Even if Hunger Man gives you more. Yeah, but it's, it's about flavor. I think I said before, if it's about flavor, Lee Cuisine. Yeah. Hands down, better flavor. But if it's for a portion, like an actual meal, Hunger Man. Hunger Man.